Hello and welcome to the topic types of bound morphemes derivational morphemes inflectional morphemes derivational morphemes they are combined with a root word or main word known as a stem they change either the semantic meaning of a word or change part of a speech of the affected word example 1 in the word happiness the addition of the bound morpheme ness to the root happy changes the word from an adjective happy to a noun happiness so we can say that ness is a bound morpheme example 2 in the word unkind un functions as a derivational morpheme for it inverts the meaning of the word formed by the root kind we have some more examples goodness ness is derivational morpheme careful for is derivational morpheme badly li is derivational morpheme example 3 incomplete in is derivational morpheme impossible in is derivational morpheme unfortunate an is derivational morpheme inflectional morphemes they are used to show if a word is plural or singular if it is past tense or not and if it is a comparative form of adjective or possessive form for example possessive apostrophe s toms davids williams s plural sons books pens etc s verb third person like in the examples plays runs reads etc ing present participle writing playing going ed past tense asked loved played etc er comparative happier merrier uglier so we can see that we have these inflection morphemes hope you understand the lesson thank you and goodbye